How to get hired as a developer in 200 seconds. Let's go. Number one, be realistic. Not everybody's getting hired for hundred thousand dollars and more. Okay. Most people are getting hired for 55 to $85,000 on the first job. And that's fine because it's not where you start. It's where you end up at. You need to get into the game. And once you're in, you're in. Number two, focus on skills that are in high demand, but got low applicants. For example, Shopify, WordPress. Again, Shopify is super hot right now. And there's not a lot of people that's actually learning how to use the platform to be able to do front end development within Shopify. And there's definitely a whole bunch of other jobs out there like content editor, email developer, web content management. Like literally there's a whole bunch of jobs that you can start doing as a web developer and you're slacking because you're only going for the top paying jobs. Now I'm not saying you're not going to get to the high paying jobs, but let's strategize this because those jobs are looking for people with some type of experience. And if you have no experience, how are you going to get the high paying job? Number three, invest in yourself. Going the free route is only going to take you so far. Yes, you can make it in, but it's going to take you longer. But guess what? There's a lot of guys out here walking around with the steroids. They're paying for resumes. They're paying for portfolios, mentorships. Like literally, there's guys out here walking around with the steroids and you're over here trying to go the organic way. Good luck with that. Now that we got that out of the way, let's talk about number four. You should be investing in making sure that someone writes your resume professionally and helps you get through the ATS, right? Pretty much the screening bots that do not let you get seen by a recruiter or by someone trying to hire you. If you don't have a portfolio that's professionally written and has the right keywords in the right format, you're not going nowhere. No one's going to even see your portfolio. Number five, make sure you have a good looking portfolio. And I suggest either hire a designer on Fiverr, 50 bucks, or go on Think Forest and you can pay 20, $25 for a complete template so you can now focus strictly on your projects, not having to build a portfolio from scratch. Focus on your projects. And number six, and this should be a no-brainer, but you should have projects relevant to the position that you are applying to. What does a JavaScript stink game have to do with a job at Nike? What does a memory game in Python have to do with you working at Adobe? It has nothing to do with it. Make sure you go in and you have projects that are relevant to the position you are applying to. Don't just go in and stuff projects that are for practice into your portfolio. Number seven, do not compare yourself to anyone out here. You don't know their Carfax. You don't know how long they've been coding. You don't know what type of jobs they had recently. You don't know what's their education background. You don't know anything. All you see is the highlights on social media. Hey, I just got hired a month in. Hey, I just got hired when they are boot camp in two months, three months, nine months, etc. You don't know their background. Okay. So you need to worry about yourself and worry about getting a bag for you. This industry is all about consistency. You can all make it in, but you have to make sure you stay consistent. Now, number Number eight, which should have been number one, is find the right platform for you. It has to have the right instructor that connects with you, the right community, and also to courses or training that is relevant to the job market. Not something that's trending and it's going to get them views, but something that is going to get you results. Now, folks, if you're looking for a platform that can provide you with the services and the support that you need to get you to your goals and dreams, guess what? Click on the link in the description, click on this video, and you could get started from there. And not only that, but you also get a crazy discount when you click on the link. So again, if you don't need the services, I will also just say, follow every single step that I just gave you right now, no matter what platform you're going to, if you already found the right one for you, it's fine, but follow every single step that's in here in this video, and you should be golden. All right, I will see you guys later. It's your boy Joe back at it again. Subscribe to the channel, like the video, show me some love in the comment section.